Hey, what's up guys? I think you guys are here for the 511 quest video. All right, well, I guess we gotta go do it, right? All right, let's go. Come on, guys. What's up, guys? Thank you so much for being with us today. If you guys are already subscribed, thank you so much. That really actually helps us out a lot. If you're not subscribed yet, think about hitting that little tiny button down below. Otherwise, pretty sure you guys are here to see the pants. And by the pants, I mean the 511 quests. Now, first off, guys, I really want to kind of get into this a little bit. I've been trying these pants out for a while, and I want to let you guys know this wasn't sent to me by 511. These I went out and bought myself because I was looking for something new to train with. So we're going to check them out, right? First thing I want to do is I want to get into the specs. Uh, the body is actually constructed of an 80% cotton, 18% polyester, and 2% elastane super twill. The front panels and back hem guards are made of a 97% cotton and 3% elastine stretch canvas. They are considered to be CCW ready as they have that extra stitching and they are able to support and not rip under that pressure. If they don't have two or four or even six pockets, they have eight pockets. What we're talking about is two in the front, two down on the legs for M4 pockets, Two normal ones on the back that use snap and loop to close them, which is a lot better than that stupid little button because nobody likes that. And then it also has two above that for two more M4 pockets. That's right, these things have four M4 pockets. Can you believe that? Ridiculous. They also have great articulation when you're turning left to right and bending down. And as well, they have this awesome gusset going down all the way from the bottom of the leg all the way through. And they say it's for running, but it's awesome because it's great for kneeling. And they're a lot different than the traditional style pants that you would have for like tactical and the stuff that I wore when I was in the army, which were super baggy. These are actually a straight fit. They're allowed to be a little bit more tight because they stretch and they move with you, as you guys can see with my ninja moves. But that being said, let's go into a few of the pros. The pros, the comfort is amazing. That's why I like to call these things my tactical pajama pants. Really, they are super comfortable. When I first put them on, all I wanted to do was snuggle up on my cozy, have a nice little cup of hot cocoa, you know, watch a winter wonderland movie, that kind of thing. Stitching is amazing too, you guys. I don't know if you guys were able to see it. They kind of have double stitching all the way around. I really liked it. And these things are ultra thin. As well, they have this awesome belt loops that you can put a 1.5 inch pistol belt inside of, so no having to worry about whether or not your cover buckle is too big for those loops. It works just fine. I'm wearing, that's all I wear with these pants is a cover buckle. Just makes it super fast and easy. The cons, I will say that these are obviously tactical pants. So if you're the guy that's looking for something a little bit more gray, man, probably not the way to go. As well, your unit's probably too cheap to buy these for you because they, the price is pretty steep. They're just under $90, coming in around $85 a piece. So that is is a con if you can afford it and you guys can run them I would highly suggest it so what are my final thoughts on these I say these things are the most comfortable tactical pants I've ever worn they're not starchy or stiff they're super movable you can kneel I'm not afraid I'm gonna blow out you know my knees when I bend or kick or move or climb or anything like that I've worn these to the range and I've worn these to work fell asleep in them they're just an amazing all-around pant so if you guys have the money you guys can afford to spend 80 90 dollars on a pair of pants I would definitely suggest these you Guys. All right, guys, like I said before, thank you so much for watching our video. If you guys enjoyed this, go ahead and hit that like button. And hey, post down in the comments what's your favorite pair of tactical pants or, you know, what you guys want to see from this channel and anything that you guys might want to hear about. Any questions you have, again, go ahead and post those in the comments below as well. I'm going to put a link to these to the 511 website. I'm not affiliated with them, uh, so it doesn't actually give me anything. It's just an easy way for you guys to go ahead and check them out yourself. But otherwise, guys, if you guys are curious about helping to support the channel, we do have a Patreon. Give a dollar to them month really helps support us getting new products so we can show you guys the products and as always guys stay smart stay safe stay alive